Hi, this is Greg from Naya IT Training. Just a quick video to talk you through getting your URL and hosting for your new website. Uh, just go online to webhosting.uk.com. The reason why I use these guys is because you know I've used them for a couple of years now and not had any problems with them. They're pretty reliable. Um, the uh, you know aftercare is good. Um, as you can see here, you've got a live chat service. Or you can also be able to call to get service as well about your website. So um, that is the reason why I use them. The area that you want to look at is down here in the center of the page to the left. You've got cPanel Hosting. Uh, the reason why you select cPanel Hosting, as this information will tell you, is that it does things like give you a nice uh, wizard that allows you to create Joomla websites very quickly and easily. And obviously, as part of that, it would mean that it actually uh, allows things like MySQL databases and PHP, all things you're going to need to be able to run your website. Also allows e-commerce tools and blogs and forums and all the rest of it. So it's really useful for um, the sort of sites that you can build with Joomla. You know, and the good thing is that all this stuff is there, so you don't actually have to learn it. You don't actually have to know it. It's um, there, and it's all you know, great wizards that you can actually use to create cool things for your website. So, um, out of the four options to get a website up and running, you're not going to need anything more than the basic package. It's got there's more than enough space uh, there for you. And once you've clicked on that, you'll now have your options to uh, purchase your URL or domain. Now, if you already have a domain, then you'll need to select the second one, which would allow you to transfer the domain over to webhostinguk.com. Now, whichever one you'd select, in this box here, you put in the name of the URL that you actually want, slash want to transfer, and click on click to continue. This will then uh, bring you over to this page, which just confirms that it is available for you to actually be able to order. And if, you know, uh, this uh, was an option where you're transferring a the domain, then again, it will be very similar to this, but it will just allow you to be able to continue with getting that domain moved over. Once you've clicked on click to continue, you come to this page. This page just confirms what you have so far. And down here, you've got the bidding cycle. Now, you want to keep the bidding cycle as annually. And you've got the um, option here to have space to back up your website. Um, now, you don't need to have it. What um, Web Hosting UK do anyway as part of their service is to back up your website. So if anything does go wrong, which has happened to me before, you're actually then able to get that, get those guys to you know reinstate their backup for you. So now you click on a Rapid SSL certificate um, or static IP. That is for people who want to have the option to sell things on their site. And I would suggest that you wait till you have those items on your site and you're ready to start selling them, because you're charged for these um, annually. And if it takes you a few weeks to get that up and running. You're just wasting those, uh, wasting uh, money buying it now. You can um, add those on later on very quickly by just clicking on the live chat button here. Uh, go on to sales, and there'll be someone eager to take your your credit card to to do that for you. So don't worry about it; it's very easy to do. So we're going to move on. The uh, next option after clicking update cart is the ID protection. ID protection is very useful for things like who dot is. So who.is is a website where you can see the owner of any domain. Um, now, you know, and when I say see, I mean like see their home address. It's up to you. I personally feel that if I don't want people to have that information, I just won't provide that information. Um, other people would provide the information, then pay to protect it. So I'll leave that one up to you. In this instance, I'm going to leave it unticked. So I just now have the uh, basic there, the basic cPanel um, hosting plan and the domain registration. And then I click on checkout. Checkout will then give you this option here to fill in all your information from your name and your address and postcode and phone number, all the stuff that who.is will then display later on. Um, you enter in the security questions and uh, then give your credit card or, or uh, however you wish to pay. 
okay so that is how you go about doing that once you have done that you um, click on red and agree the terms of, terms of service and click on complete order and once that's done you're complete okay so it takes around about 10 minutes before you get an email back from web posting UK to confirm that it is all done um, and then you'll be good to go so thanks very much I hope this has been of use to you and I'll see you at the course ready to uh, build your Joomla sites. Bye for now.